I wanted to get a quick video out to help out with some of our customers. I had a customer contact me last week, and this is not the first time I've run into this, that when he was using a 19 millimeter in the 19 millimeter guide, it didn't fit all that well. It fit a little loose. And what he was experiencing is when he put it in here, it still had a little bit of extra tightening that needed to be done. And then what happened was, as you put the drill bit in, it wouldn't, it would be bound up like in the middle and the teeth would be hitting the inside and damaging the teeth. Whereas this one with a normal 19 has no problems, no restrictions whatsoever. But on his case, what happened was, is he damaged the inside of the drill bit by rubbing on the inside of this. Didn't break any teeth off, but was having a lot of difficulties with it. He felt that it was being a little bit too small. So what I've done to fix that problem, and we'll get this out to you if you do need it, is every once in a while you get something a little bit smaller. Use this as an example. Still looks pretty good, but still a little on the loose side. But when we try to tighten it up in the 19, so it's all nice and tight now, what happens is, is you get some binding or some restriction. I can't get there. Now it's only a little bit of a difference in size between the 19, but apparently that's what he was running into. It was a little bit too small. And since he was dealing with a spinning lug nut and stud, he really needed to grip it down. So I did a little bit of research and I found some great shims. These are aluminum shims and I can provide them free for no cost, no, no charge, get them out to you as quickly as possible. And what, basically what you do is you put a shim on the outside of your lug nut. Basically we just want to make it a little bit thicker. For this example I use just a piece of tape. And then we put it back in there. Get the guide loose here. Then you're able to insert it into the guide make the guide just a little bit wider, the mouth of it a little bit wider so it's now nice and nice and tightly fitting just by shimming it just a little bit there. Pretty easy to do and you're able to put your guide back, you clamp back on to the guide tighten it down. So now we're nice and tight we made the mouth just a little bit bigger by putting a shim on it really easy to do. Now you have absolutely no restriction for the drill bit. You won't be damaging the thread, the shaft. You won't be damaging the head. Apologize that we didn't make them perfect for every single lug nut on the market, but I think this little shim will be a big help for everybody that's dealing with this problem. Just reach out to me, let me know, and I'll get these to you right away. Thank you.